Scales has been under pressure lately. He's been out on social media calling fire and brimstone on his wife of just one year. It's safe to say that there's, there's something going on inside of his marriage. <clears throat> Only just, uh, I think, over the week or before these, uh, the current instance, he put up a, a, a post where he said, pray for my mental health. Mm -hmm. After which he put another one saying, whatever you do, make sure you get married, make sure you don't get married to a heartless person. Mm -hmm. And that all preceded uh, an eventual uh, comment uh, which he posted something about his wife mm -hmm. um, grieving uh, his mother who had just passed. Yeah. Um, but he thought that it was all just a ruse. Mm -hmm. That's the way, the summary, just put it as a summary. But... I don't know. So as, as a case study, right? As a, you see, the thing is, he's lost his mother only mm. just recently. Mm. It's, about a, it's about a week that I saw the post. Yeah. Mm. I don't know whether it was that exact day. That exact day, It would seem everything's happening at, at the same time. time. Yeah, I would just say, yeah. So, mm. it was, it's got, as a case study, there's something he said there. Uh, uh, don't get married to a heartless person. Mm. person. And uh, just one year, man. Just mm. one year. Just one year. <laughs> I, I, he has said it all. Mm -hmm. He has said it, but a, a lot of times you might not know. Mm -hmm. Might not know what exactly? That the person is who the person is. Hey, yeah. so calm that, people, down. There's a lot of people unpacking get to, to hear calm you down. little Calm time. down, Mike. The reason why I was, so him not knowing you someone to calm what, down? heartless? Why are you telling me to calm down? Uh, mm -hmm. you, so you can't just assume the person is everything. Can't just one, take one you can't side of the story. Side. No, one, I'm not one, saying, two. I'm not saying, no, I'm not saying the person's hardly. I'm saying that you might not know the person mm -hmm. until mm. after you get married. Yeah. You see, it's not, okay. about, being, thing is it's not about being heartless or go. not. You okay. understand? I am just talking about compatibility and yeah. people and yeah. how you don't know somebody until you actually do I've it with them. I've got plenty to say about that, but Titi, you, you Yeah, so I'm, I'm, I'm just thinking about the fact that he is in, he is grieving. Yes. And mental state of anyone after, you know, losing a loved one, someone they're obviously so close to, someone that he says he actually wrote saddest day of his life. Yeah. And maybe the response or a reaction from his spouse wasn't what he expected. Mm -hmm. Maybe she's not expressing herself the way mm -hmm. he would have liked to. We don't know what exactly happened for him to make such a comment. But it's obvious that he is in a particular place right now where he just needs support. There is that factor he to be considered. He needs care and everything. So for when she put <coughs> a post uh, expressing her grief, mm -hmm. you know, um, his response is, I think, I think his response was just based on how he was feeling at that yeah. point. I don't think, um, I don't think she's I actually as heartless as I, you think. I would like to agree with you on mm. that one. I think that when you're grieving, and I have been in such a situation where everything went wrong after that call came in. I lashed out at everything. Even here in the studio, and I'd like to apologize to, I think, a few people on that day. I think it was Juwon and Aji. Wow. It was, a, it was a bad instance for me. However, in the case of social media propagating uh, our um, flaws, mm. and in this case, I think it's a flaw, and I think somebody should call the gentleman back and say, yeah. calm down. Yeah. Things happen like so. A marriage of just one year, where you feel the social media is a bed where you can throw all your frustrations on and out your partner. If anything, marriage has taught me that the closest person you have and the one person that you cannot afford to out yeah. is your partner. You will regret it six months, a year, or five years down the line. Yeah. It will be one of the biggest regrets of your life. Question, what if it's a cry for help? So now, there is there that are, argument there issues that had, have Mike. happened where yeah. there they is said, that why argument. didn't you talk out? Yeah, In sure. fact, I, I dare but say, you're rather who, air, thank you're you rather air on the side of speak caution. Social media is not, not where you dump these things. Yeah. Seek professional help, mm -hmm. perhaps. He That's says, pray for my mental health. I, I, feel, mental I, health I agree, I understand, but I feel like sometimes mm -hmm. it might, you don't, we don't, like now, we don't even know if he lies because of grief. Mm -hmm. It might just be the last option, you don't know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so for me, whenever those kind of things happen, mm -hmm. yeah. As much as people that are around him, mm -hmm. some people might not even respond until they see it on social media, and they are close to you. Hmm. You know what? I like this dynamic here. Uh, and they're close from to you. a single sure. person and then married people. Sure. There's a lot to unpack that we can't accommodate inside these few minutes. Maybe you can send a message. Use the hashtag #WakeUpNigeria on TVC, and we'll comment.